Well, good morning. We're up and at them before the sun this morning. All of us pretty fired up to get some work done today. Had a heck of a rainstorm come in last night, so the lot's going to be a little greasy this morning. It was getting greasy yesterday. Brandon's up and at him this morning. No good? No, no, still. <laughs> what happened? 1.30 I was up puking. 3 o'clock I was up. Huh. You don't like that chop suey, huh? Uh, apparently he didn't like me. Huh. Well, good morning. Morning, Joe. What are you thinking this morning? You what? <laughs> Well, good morning, guys. We're here for, I guess this is the third day, day number three now. This is it really? Yeah, day three. Donnie, it's only wow. day two for you. You missed a day. I missed, hey, the, hey, I missed the first. You slept day. through the first twelve cord. <laughs> we're feeling good. We're we're looking good. We made some serious progress. It downpoured last night, so I'm a little nervous how greasy that lot's gonna be now, because uh, it was getting greasy yesterday without any rain. We were having some trouble getting turned around and backed out of here and stuff like that, so I had to hook on to the old Dodge and yank it for them. Yeah, it's big mud ties I get on that thing won't get around you. Yeah. yeah. Then greasy. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's getting greasy though, so we got to be careful today. But plan today is to get another 10 dozen, 10 dozen, 14 loads of shale in here for the base, and then we're going to move back over to that nice pit with uh some wicked nice top gravel and uh haul that in too so that's the plan for today it's sprinkling a little bit right now we got reinforcements coming uh really excited that stevie's gonna make his appearance um stevie's gonna be bringing a 16 foot dump trailer so we're gonna have some reinforcements there and it'll cut our load time in half see what donnie's doing in the old trap and check Pancakes and sausage this morning. Good enough. Might need some for Stevie. I don't know. Well, he, he don't he eat isn't much. Here by seven o'clock, he gets nothing. Seven. He, he if he ain't here by seven, we'll send him home. He got. He gets lunch, right, guys? Yeah. Don't like we got a generator going for the coffee pot. Yeah. The boys don't like my percolated coffee. It's hard to beat percolated coffee, but apparently they don't like chewing on their coffee, so. They brought a coffee pot and a generator. Don't bother me none. Tastes pretty good, so. We're into the coffee right now. I get a little bit on my shirt, I guess. But we're into the coffee right now, and Donnie's gonna cook up some flapjacks and some sausages. We're gonna have ourselves a pretty good breakfast. I buy a new set of tires every year, but I try to get as close to the end as I can. Oh, Generally, if I go on a moose hunt, I usually put new tires on right for a moose hunt, or I'll wait until December and then put them on right before I go to Ohio. That way I got new tires to travel out there with. Yeah. But I don't, it don't matter what I put on that truck, 30, 35,000 miles. Ignorant. They were supposed to be a real good tire. Which they, they did wear decent, but the traction's terrible on them. They don't get around that great, but they did. I tried to get a few more miles on them because, geez, I was buying like Duratrax and stuff. Christ, I couldn't get 25,000. They got around good, but just towing heavy trails and stuff, just smoking them right off. Best tires I ever had was them studded snow tires I got there a couple of years ago. Them things are incredible, weren't they? This is difficult. Yeah. This is impossible. Hanks get stuck in that. Once you get your treads <laughs> full of grease, it's over. It's over. It's over. Especially if there's, if there's not enough tread to have it spinning and kicking it. Yep, so Donnie collects the sap off his woodlot and he brings it over to Wayne Jones. Yep. And Wayne Boyle. I'm going to cut that. I want to be he the one to his head. He's in his You head. got that on camera, yes! <laughs> Not good. Greasy.
We almost need to go get some good gravel. We're in a bad situation otherwise. Oh, we're gonna jackknife the trailer from back down in there. Just down this. Just do Look at this. I almost I hate right to say up. it, but we might need to switch gears and go get that clean gravel. I was dragging, just me spinning. Yeah. Absolutely. Once your front tires get up on this right there, she started digging the bottom. Other than that, she was spinning. Ah. Uh, You hook on to that, I'll go grab the flat deck. We'll head out to the other pit. Yeah. And we might be able to meet Steve before he even gets in. He had to grab a load on his way in. Yeah. All right. Uh, I don't see any other options yet. I'll follow you up. I'll, sw I'll swap with you up to the next pit. I got to go back and get my flat deck. That's right. Yeah. Uh, just pull her over then or leave it in the road, just whatever. Drop her wherever. Yeah. Got to get some dirt. We gotta get some good gravel. I mean, I want to. We're gonna have to put gravel here. Everywhere. Yep. No choice. Even if you and I have to spread it by shovel for some of it, you know, on this road. Literally, anyway. taking shovelfuls and throwing it on the ground. Like all this. Yeah, trailer brakes definitely work on that. Literally, just taking shovelfuls yeah. and throwing it down there is gonna help tremendously. Jesus first, Christ! <laughs> for the first load. Tighten them brakes a little. Is that a roll high? We gotta change plans, fellas. Gotta set it back a little bit, but it's gotta we gotta do it. Cause uh cause cause getting jack knife there stuck in there is gonna set it back. Gonna be loaded. I don't even know how we're gonna do it. The first load he and I take. We're, we're gonna, gonna shovel. We're, we're gonna, gonna just shovel. Just rake it, yeah. But we're gonna yeah. literally stop right here and shovel our whole way down. That's what I'd say. Yeah. I wouldn't mind getting this off. When you back around, shovel it off the corner. Yeah. Right? Yep. Well, we gotta change plans, fellas. We're just so slimed in, greased in from all that rain last night that I mean, we're, every truck's getting stuck all the time so we're gonna we're gonna go after that nice that real nice gravel it's four miles that way so in order to get it i gotta swap take the dump trailer brandon's gonna take the flat trailer bring it up to the excavator load up the excavator and run his excavator over to that other pit and then i'm gonna go over with the dump trailer and hopefully we catch stevie somewhere along the way and we uh we get a couple loads because we're gonna have to i think the first load or two camera and I'll be shoveling by hand to try to spread out so we can get some traction just going up and down our own hill it's it's awful how greasy she is down a little but yeah. we're, we're still ahead of schedule you know if you get breakfast done a little quicker you know we wouldn't be behind schedule I know I felt like sleeping in Jesus you wore your green one today well I've had it on I, all I wore my red one we keep I've doing had it, it all yeah Jeez, isn't this awful? Well, they had to be in the A team when there is no B team. Cameron, yeah. moose walked down the road this morning. Yeah. Okay. We're really in trouble. 
Lift her up. I know it.
That's a big trail. Hey, Stevie! How's it going? Pretty good. Good to see you. Good to see you, Brandon. This is Brandon. Nice to bud. meet you, bud. Good, good. How are you guys? Good. <laughs> we, we thought, sure, you must have problems somewhere. Oh, no. It took Cause... me a while. I left at 5.30. Oh, okay. Okay, Joey said, oh, he must be leaving by 4.30. Well, that was the plan, but <laughs> yeah. didn't work out. Abby didn't sleep too good, so uh, that means I didn't get was... much. And yeah. So I took an extra hour this morning. Yeah, what the hell. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Joe just, we got loaded up here with one load. He left about 10 minutes ago. Okay. So Perfect. I guess I was we hoping could... I'd see you guys on the way in, so I yeah. load the trailer up before well, we get to the camp. You know, yesterday we hauled shale out of a sh the shale pit up beyond I the... I saw the live video last night. Oh, okay. Home, yeah. And uh, it got so muddy down in where we're dumping it, we we had big trouble getting in and out. Oh, uh, no. So now and, we're trying to gravel the and, hill down over so we got traction to get back up over. Oh. Can't, can't pull the hill. Yeah, you can't. We got like 15 loads down on the pad yeah. yesterday, though. We probably got... Eight to ten inches on a lot of the main pad yesterday. Oh wow! Yeah. You you won't believe the area. <laughs> no, you won't Joe believe it. Friggin' cotton. <laughs> <laughs> he, yeah, he told me ten or fifteen trees. I bet we cut fifteen, twenty cords. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, Sounds about right. Yeah. So, I guess we'll load him up, Brandon, and yep. See what's what. This is a bigger trailer than uh, Joey's, I think. It's a 16 foot. Yeah. And it's a pretty good load just with my truck towing that thing. That's heavy. Yeah. 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 Wait till you get loaded no. down. <laughs> I know. We blew we one tire one. yesterday. On a, we on cut the, trailer, the we cut the sidewall on a piece of shale. Oh yeah. On the trailer. Yeah. But. Uh, How you feeling? I'm not a hundred percent. I can tell you that. Yeah. Monday was. What day was it? That was uh, Thursday. Thursday. Oh, I couldn't. I was bad, <laughs> puking, oh, and no. yeah, I was sick as a dog. Yeah. Yeah, this is good. Good gravel here. <laughs> Is this the free stuff, or is this the no, stuff we gotta buy? No, this is the stuff we gotta buy. Oh. I think he said three dollars a yard. Brandon's pretty good on the machine, huh? Yeah, he is. Yeah, he's done a super job clearing that area. not a tree left standing on the whole lot. <laughs> well, Sounds like we're pretty close. Well, we, uh, yeah, we took, I mean, uh, Joe wanted an area to pack and to be able to swing around with a trailer. Yeah. So I think we got that, yeah. and so. And then how about the, uh, the driveway that was there? That Was that pretty Oh, it's pretty muddy. It, yeah. That's where this gravel is going. Okay. Quite a load. Yeah. <laughs> get up that hill. Yeah. There's a lot of weight on his truck. Yeah. I think that's enough. <laughs> if I was you, Stevie, when I met hit them on the road, have Cameron get out with you, maybe. Yeah. Okay. But I would do what you do. Won't spill anymore, at least. Yeah. <laughs> all right. See you guys in a bit. All right. Yeah. We'll be all set. Look all right, huh? The squat's pretty good, but I'll go slow. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I think you'll be all right. Okay. Yeah. I'll unhook that. We'll switch them out when you get back. Okay. 
something that trailer right here. Right. Huh? Is that three quarter? Or? It's a three quarter time, but it'll handle it a lot better. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah, 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 We got a mess, don't yeah. We got a mess down here, don't we? I don't know if we're gonna get the septic thing. No, I don't think we will. We're having a major setback today. You want this on the roadway or in? Now what do you do? Well, I don't know if that was a good idea or not, but we're in here now. There he is, the man, the myth, the legend. Stevie. Yeah, we... <laughs> Welcome, buddy. Thank you. Good to be here. You guys got a lot of work done. Oh my God, we've been going hard. Holy smokes. Could not believe how much clearing we had to do. Yeah. It was so dense and thick. Well, look at that pile. And that's all firewood hardwood yeah, perfect but nice piece of birch there too oh yeah no we can get out with that okay. space line right. if it's in the right spot this stuff packs good doesn't it That's jail. yeah I think it's, this one is loose and, and jagged like that before it before mm. it flattens out pretty easy to cut a tire on it we lost one. On a trailer? Yeah. We I lost one yesterday. Plugs and... Yeah, sidewall. Oh, was it? Yeah. yeah. Kind of had. No good. So I think what I'm going to do, fellas, is I'm going to... I'm going to back this up a little ways if I can. And just dump it anywhere in here. Probably dunk. Couldn't we dump Stevie's load on that hill? I'm assuming he's gonna push it in front of him. I got it. I kind of have to. And if he can spread it for this turn around, it's golden. There you go, director.
This is the perfect combination, Donnie. Yeah. Base yeah. and and top coat's what top it is. Top coat, yeah, that top coat is great. Yep. I feel like we're going the wrong way. Yeah, seems like we are. We'll wait for him down at this pit. <laughs> They are going to be pissed. Oh, they are going to be wild. All right, guys, it's 11 o'clock. We are running way behind schedule. We got three loads in today of the good gravel and one of the shale up the top of the hill. But right now, we did what we had to do. We need it. You know, today and tomorrow is a uh, deadline, so uh, got to do it. Yep. the old digit on that one. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, we really scared him to death. Yeah. <laughs> Poor guy. Uh. All right guys, we're back and we're loading up in the shale pit. Just got a, we did a moderate load this, uh, this time. We're gonna give a hell and see how the new racetrack works out. I know we might need to take a couple of these home with us. If we're taking a couple spruce, we might as well take a couple cedar. Guys, we are cruising now. This is uh, load number five. Number five since we come back to the shelter. She's getting awful bony up here, but it'll still pack and it'll still make some good base. He's he's looking around to see if there's less bones, but it'll it'll work. Uh, Stevie's trailer, we got like a dump and a half out of it and the battery died. He, he put the charger on last night, but it, it didn't come to full charge. So, you know, you're going to have mess ups like that. You're going to have stuff not working anytime you take on a project like this or do a wilderness trip. So we, we threw my little Honda in the back of Cameron's truck there, plugged it right into the charger. So it's actually charging every time he's running back and forth. And the whole time he's getting loaded and sitting here, it, uh, that battery's taking a charge, so it should be able to dump each time and uh, keep us in keep us in business. So we're looking good. That's that other trailer is a heck of a nice trailer. It's got a uh, dual pistons underneath it, 16 footer. So beauty. This one's a 14 with a single. Uh, this one's a really nice trailer too. So we're looking good. We're doing all right for the for, for what we got for a crew. Brandon is uh, getting beat up on this machine the last couple days, but doesn't seem to mind. You don't complain much. I don't think he'd say poop if he had a mouthful of it. He just said poop. perfect nice. yeah as long as we don't jam ourselves up as long as we stay smart where we're dumping how oh, far where, where are you dumping them way back in that corner yeah bottom left corner so far oh. there she go maybe hook my battery charger back up to it Does maybe that charger's down? not strong enough yeah, maybe thing's not. only size of a big dink big dink it's open. that's closed I know it's closed. Well, we got a dead battery. Yeah. We're going to work around it. We got 15 different fixes we could do. How many shovels we got? Well, let's try that first since we got it right here anyways. We got 15 different fixes. We're going to try a jumper pack first. If that don't work, we're going to try. I got a jumper pack. I know it'll work. If that doesn't work, then we'll swap it out to a bigger charger. That's just got like a little NOCO charger on there. We'll get it charged. We got a, we got a Honda inverter 2000 i running there donnie and i gotta go back up and get another load and get some lunch 
We're gonna go get another load, get some lunch, drive some food right into us. Yeah. Drive a little bit into Brandon because he looks pretty famished. Is he? Oh, he's awful famished. Oh, oh, oh man, she's rough. She's rough. She's rough. She's gonna be nice when we get done. Yeah. Big Brook rough oh, cut. God. What, what was that? that? Oh, I don't know. What have you been doing the whole time, Dottie? Making sandwiches. Jeez. I see you got some good middles in there. Was any of that good? Jeez. It was getting pretty shaky. Yeah, I know. <laughs> when I bought it, it was shaky, but that's yeah. the only one they had. Yeah. There was only one watermelon in the whole yeah. town of Ashland, and it, yeah. it was soft on one end, but both I, ends, I actually... Both ends were soft. Both ends? Yeah. Oh, I stuck my finger right into it when I went to pick it up, and yeah. I said, well, so. Yeah, it's pretty well, but I, I got some firm pieces, pretty pretty good ones in the middle. Beautiful. So we're going to have some watermelon for lunch. Donnie made sandwiches for everybody. We're going to drive them into us. He's got yep. a bag of chips kicking around somewhere. A bag of chips and some cookies. And he even made cookies straight out of Miss Hannaford's kitchen. Right. We're going to drive them into us and get back at it. They are not going to slow us down, I promise you that. We're not We're not giving Brandon his lunch till in between loads. <laughs> Meep. <laughs> About nicest table in the North Main Woods. Yeah. Couldn't be better. All right, I didn't put any mustard or pickles. Oh, I'm gonna load them right up with pickles. So this is pickles. So this this is, is Dave's bread and butter pickles. Good. Yeah. Mustard. David Ames makes these. It's the only good thing David Ames does. The only thing David Ames does right all year. How, how is he at golf? Terrible. The worst golfer I've ever seen. <laughs> He's worse at poker than he is at golf, if you can believe it. Want a couple of them on your sandwich? I got mine on pretty on it. Oh, you heard he did? Yeah. Well, I didn't know if anybody else wanted any. We're going to get it here. It's coming this way. Might want to be sitting in the truck. Yep, we're going to have to move lunch. It happens. Can't have nothing nice. We are sleeping in the trapper's cabin. There's room for you in there. Oh, yeah. You alright with that? I'll be alright. Yeah, mine can't. I I like take up the whole thing. Did you stay dry oh, last night, nice Donnie? Yeah. Did you? Wow. Good. If you want something to cuddle with, just whisper a few mice in. You almost got out, Joey. Where's the shovel? You got a shovel right there? Don't yeah. Maybe you can go forward now, Joey, when he gets unhooked. Do you think he can go forward now? Oh, yeah, I think. Want to unhook, Joe? That's the way you got to go anyways. I mean, he's got you now. I think it would have been fine. He let off right at the last second. It jackknifed a little bit. But she was headed out. See, uh... I mean, if Joey pulls forward, do you think he can get out? I don't know. I don't want you to get 
This is aggravation. <laughs> you don't need. <laughs> Seems like you could go forward now, Joey. I don't know. Seems like she's broken now. Huh? What's broke? Oh, we bent that friggin' thing. Broke it right off over there. I figured there was some sort of malfunction. Oh, we were stuck good. Yeah, we were. No. Greg, he got stuck too. He brought back half a load for you. We are both stuck at one point. What do you guys do? Go fix the road? It's not the road, it's down below. Probably, yeah, let's let all these two loads in, call it good. On the shale. Flatten the shale out and see where we are. It's just how do you turn around or what? Yeah. Yeah, I went too low. Where'd you get hung up, Cam? Right in the middle. We'll get these two loads down there. We'll dump them, then we'll see what we got. We might need to bring you down, then switch pits. But let's see what happens after we get these two loads. Okay. What's smoking? What's smoking? Generator. She had oil? Oh. She, uh, that last time out, she took a tumble. Started smoking. Never seen a Honda smoke like that. <laughs> the generator smoking? Pulling up the hill that last time. I stopped to pick him up and it went upside down and it was still running. I shut it off and we run up, filled up, came back, started it up and yeah, she's definitely smoking. She must have put some oil into the... You think? Huh. We'll have to keep an eye, we'll have to check the oil and I imagine she's got a low oil shut off but it's probably didn't shut off when it was upside down. Yeah, me too. I've never seen a Honda smoke before. Get a multi tool on you? Oh, no. I'm sure she got a little You got a screwdriver on there? Probably a little fuel oil it wasn't supposed to. She won't dump? Won't dump, no. Won't dump. That's where you wanted them, Donnie? No. I was trying to get over there. You got hung up right there. She still plugged in? Oh, 
Oh, did you guys turn this back on to 10? Yeah, I just did. Yeah. Okay. He's dead, so we only get to dump it about six inches at a time. <coughs> He's hung up. We took a half hour to get it up that high, Donnie. I don't think it much can walk and dump unless you I'm gonna. You don't think it'll dump? Well, it's up against the pile now that's all the pile. Oh. We might have to have Stevie pull him. Might have to have Stevie give him a little tug forward. See what I mean? Try to rock it. There you go. Okay. that forward up that dodge pull it yep all you gotta do is give him a little yank i mean he's stuck he's almost heading downhill and he's stuck oh it's just been been a challenge guys every single load has been a challenge for one reason or another but we're here for a challenge. We wouldn't be here if we weren't here for a challenge. Generator flipped over, he said, on one of these runs and was upside down running. Now she's smoking. So imagine she dumped some oil down into the valves or something I don't know hopefully she comes out of it not good so while it was upside down it wasn't charging and that's why we're down to nothing on this I think, I think get him going like a foot or two is all that should free him up okay. maybe two foot There's no hooks to hook on to huh? what are you supposed to hook on to you can't get it in there? I want to try to get it through there and I can hook it to that side. I can't do nothing.
didn't like that. What happened? Spit hydraulic fluid up going down. Busted a hose. No, right here. I found the foam. I don't is there another cap? Absolutely. There is? Guys, we done switch gears. Got all that shale flattened out nice on the lot. Pretty nice, pretty nice. And we're gonna top dress it now with some beautiful gravel. Take a look at this stuff. That's good stuff right there. It is back to hard. like it's lead. But that's the good stuff there. So we're going to try to get, I don't know, maybe, maybe 30 yards, 40 yards of that on the lot, you know, three or four at a time and get that spread for the top. That'll be, that'll be the top for our parking area, for walking around, for for everything on top of that shale so we shouldn't have a problem with any water um, in the future we shouldn't have anything slimy or slippery or, or too wet in the future even if it pours that stuff is so dense and heavy it's a little wet too but it's uh it's all i can do to tow it and get it uphill so stevie's truck that f-150 isn't gonna be able to tow with a 16 footer so we're uh, we're making a little move. We're making a little move. No, you set over an inch and a half. Yep, wind it back. Yep, straighten her out. You got it. Oh. Yeah, the old lost a trick. Pull her ahead, aim left. Oh!
be all you now. Nice, and it is powerful. Yeah. Beautiful. We think of that, old boy. Amazing. Hard to believe. You can't even recognize it. It's the same spot. Until you look down there and see the old cabin. Yep. Sitting in the hole. Yep. Rotten wood. Yep. We're not going anywhere here. High and dry. Bunch of shale for a base. Nice gravel. It's gonna be awesome. Sure is. We're doing it right. Yep. It's taken it's taken several extra days and a lot of hard work and hard on the equipment, but we're doing it right and that's the key. So this this won't sink into the ground, it won't rot out, it won't be muddy, won't definitely won't get a flood. So Donnie was hollering when I pulled in that time. It's uh it's a little past six o'clock right now. Or seven. Six or seven? Seven. Yeah, it's about 7.15. All right, 7.15. So we're over 13 hours in the workday today, so I hope we get paid for the whole day. <laughs> <laughs> but, but no, there she is right there, and got some really nice top gravel here to spread once we get enough of these loads in. Yep. We should be able to get a handful more on the perimeter. A couple over here before we start getting too tight. I can actually start to see the finished product in my, in my mind. Nice. I'm not too good at visualizing a, a project when it's full of trees. and But now I can picture the cabin sitting right there. Beautiful. Donnie's got a nice fire going. Oh yeah. Got a little smudge. He spoils us rotten. Yeah, he Cook, sure does. Cooking us a pork tenderloin with mashed potatoes and corn. <laughs> We're so lucky to have him. So lucky. Well, you see your accommodations for the night. Oh, jeez, look at that. Fiddleheads. Smokes. Fire going, Nani. Got the fiddleheads out there. Fiddlehead. I went and picked those down the... By the brook. Oh, jeez. Yeah, got those canned just for the supper. So, supper smelling good. Holy smokes. What'd man. you bring, your oven? Oh, yeah, I got I got a roast in the There's oven. There's an oven underneath that yeah, oven. Yeah, but I don't dare to light it. I don't know if it works or not. You don't want to kill any of that mice. I don't want to, no. So. <laughs> what do you got in the uh, pressure cooker? I got potatoes going. Almost done. And... Pork tenderloin. Look at Whoa. those. Look at that roast. Wow. Oh my god, Donnie. That looks edible. And we got corn, cucumbers. Oh, you found your cooker top. Where was it? What, that one? No, this one. Oh, I, it was out in my lean to. There. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. On the shelf. Yeah. Good find. Good. Is there enough for me, Donnie? Highly yeah, recommend. yeah, get in there. <laughs> Highly recommend. Yeah. <laughs> you got a five star review on Yelp. You want some fiddleheads? 
I'm gonna have to try them, yep. I yeah. heard they're spicy. Oh, I love spicy fiddleheads. Do you? Okay. Mickey brought them over. Oh, really? Yeah. I gotta get the opener here. Man, this grub's good. Tenderloin. Good. Good day. I'd say it was a pretty darn good day. Oh, yep. Rough day, good day. We struggled. We struggled. We moved back, forth, up, down. We're in good shape, though. That, that looks pretty good. We got a plan for tomorrow. We might not like it. What are you thinking? Early hammer. Oh. Early hammer. <laughs> handfuls half dozen loads bring the machine back here scratch that out flatten this so we can get around again scratch out that donnie and stevie will put together the lego kit what when we go back and haul whatever we need to finish her off so oh, just that. gotta means just means we gotta haul the machine back extra time you all right with that i think we can I mean, whatever, but if we get up in the morning and haul till noontime, I think we'd be done. I don't think we'd have room. No? I think we'd be jammed up so tight over here. Maybe. Ain't no big deal. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We can, we can st I'd say we still got room for quite a few loads, though, don't we? Yeah, but that bird's coming tomorrow for the inspection at 3 from a long way away so we got to tell them in the morning not spicy. no nope. if, if you don't think uh -huh. we can do it yeah i'll tell you we're doing the right thing this is going to be a hell of a base for a camp yeah isn't uh, it donnie it sure i was telling is. stevie there's 99.9 percent .9 of camps get built on whatever's there yeah yeah we're so far ahead of the game <laughs> just look at this one we're doing it we are <laughs> doing it right oh we're on high ground <laughs> Oh dear. I was telling Donnie your wife's pretty presentable. <laughs> Compared to me? I wasn't expecting it. <laughs> no, what what the was you expect? Something off Trail Park Boys? You missing tea? I couldn't believe it. I said, I said, Who the hell is that? You go, that's my wife. And I go, no, sir. You go, that was my kids too. They look like they were just coming out of Sunday school. Oh. They were on the dock at Cat Hands. Yeah. All right, Donnie. Donnie. All right, Donnie. Great day. Great day of work. Thank you, Donnie. Donnie, what do we got? What do we got to look forward to tomorrow? Uh, tomorrow morning. I'm, yeah. I'm gonna do the donut. Thing. Hold on, you're doing donuts tomorrow I'm morning. Doing, I'm doing donuts tomorrow morning. All right. So, so you guys hear a, that? There's a couple guys, three guys here. They haven't had them, I think. I've you, had them. You, you guys hear them? that? Okay. Tune in tomorrow if you want to see Donnie's here, donuts. Dr. Mike's camp. Yeah. yeah. Well, that is going to do it for day number three. I'm in my truck getting ready for bed. I'm going to do a little wash up with some baby wipes and uh, do a little reading before bed tonight. Had an awesome day today. We definitely faced some challenges today with some things breaking, some breakdowns and getting stuck a lot of tight quarters in here greasy underneath the wheels and but we were able to get it done and got it done really uh really really good job these guys are animals they know how to work and you know they they like the challenge just like i do you know that's kind of why we're here so when you when you guys face a challenge like that you know the whole job itself is a challenge then you throw those obstacles in there and it makes it even harder you know don't don't fall to the challenge you know make sure you overcome find a way around an obstacle or over an obstacle or or just figure out a way to 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 get the job done and do it right so we're pretty pumped that we got a super base here to build this cabin on we're gonna top dress it with some nice fine gravel tomorrow uh top dress the, a nice parking area so we have a good area to recreate and park and uh we're also going to do put in a super unnecessary leech field tomorrow too so we got that going um stay tuned got donnie's donuts in the morning is the rumor 
So if I wake up early, maybe I'll do a load of gravel or two right before the sun comes up and, uh, and be ready for Donnie's Donuts. Really appreciate all the support, guys. All the support for the channel, support for the project. We'll keep making these videos if you keep watching them. Thanks again, guys. Appreciate it. See you tomorrow.